We're going to start by pointing out some of the elements of your charge controller kit. That's your charge controller, that's your relay, that's your rectifier, and you have two dump loads and a couple of fuses. We're going to show you first how to connect your rectifier to the PMA. There are three back wires coming out of your PMA, and you can connect each of those wires to the green wires coming out of your rectifier. Now you'll notice it doesn't matter which green wires you connect from the rectifier to your PMA. Now the other thing you'll want to do is you'll want to use shrink tubing so you won't have any shorts in your circuit, which we don't show in this video. So now we're going to make the connections from our charge controller to the battery bank. So you're going to take the, the black wire coming out of the rectifier and you're going to connect it to the negative terminal of your battery bank using a proper sized ring terminal. Now you're going to take the red wire coming out of the fuse and you're going to use again an appropriate size ring terminal to connect uh, to your battery. Now you notice we're not actually making the connections. This video is just for demonstration purposes. So just be sure to use the proper materials uh, and make these connections as appropriate. So at this point, you've basically made all the connections necessary to connect your charge controller to your battery bank. Now you can proceed to the installation instructions to set your trip points.